Okay, so hi, I'm packing. Um, I'm going on a trip, you guys. I know, like, okay. I'm like all over the place in my head. Like, I, so many things, like, I want to say, but I don't want to say. And I have no makeup on, like, zero makeup. I, yeah, I took my extensions out. Um, and I feel like my lips look bigger when I don't have makeup on. Um, okay, so I want to show you guys what I'm packing. I'm going to talk to you guys about my trip. I hate the way I look right now. I look like a fucking wreck. Like, why do my lips look purple? My lips look purple. It's disgusting. I can't put myself in the viewfinder. Yeah, like, I look gross today. Disgusting. Okay, anyway. Um, okay. Hey, what's up? Okay, so yeah, I'm kind of like a wreck right now. Um, I, I don't go on, I, I want to go on vacations, but I just can't because I own a business, you guys know that, and I just like, I just feel like every time I want to go on a vacation, like I can't, like this like work gets in the way, so I'm finally going on one, and um, uh, you guys know it's like really hard for me to keep like, I'm like, I think I'm just like too honest and like too, what's the word? Like, I don't, I'm not fake at all, I feel like, sorry. So, I know, is that like, am I tuning my heart? No, I'm just like telling the truth. Um, I just can't like keep things to myself. So I think that's better. Um, so, I don't know. I just like, um, my head is all over the place. Like, I want to go on this trip, but honestly, I wish it was under different circumstances. And so, sorry if this seems scrambled or whatever. I just like, my life is like this right now. You know what I mean? Like, my life is like this. Like, I don't know. Like, <laughs> the only stable thing in my life is like my business. So I feel so much anxiety like leaving. Like I don't want to go because that's like the what I like love so much. And I like leaving it for a week is like stressful, but I've already like you know, already planned and accounted for it. So like orders will still be going out. You don't have you know what I mean? Like everything is fine. Like the business still runs when I'm gone. I just don't like to not be there all the time. And there's just so much other things going on. But anyway, I'm going to London and Paris, and I'm gonna go there for a week, and um, something really amazing happened. Like, to, that, something that I really, really wanted for a long time um, might be happening because of a really great friend. And um, I'll talk about that later, so we'll see, but I'm not gonna talk about it right now. Um, that just like happened after the trip was planned. It was like a godsend. So I'll be talking about that. I'm really excited. Um, and I'm excited, but like I told you, I'm not excited like because I'm just like so stressed out about leaving and about just like other things. Like I just, uh, I don't, you know what I mean? I don't know. I'm not talking about it. So I'm just, I don't know. I'm also, I'm also really anxious about going there and gaining weight. Like I know I'm going to like eat a lot. Like I just can't, I don't know. I'm just, I'm, I'm just very honest with you guys. I'm telling the truth. All right. So I want a couple things I want to talk about before I show you. So anyway, did I say I wanted to share like what I'm packing, what I'm bringing? Well, is this, I don't, you guys, I'm like all over the place right now. Like I feel, first of all, I don't like the way I look. Like I feel really ugly in this viewfinder. I feel like I'm like really ugly. I feel like very plain Jane with this hair and like my nose looks really wide right now and my lips look ridiculous. So I'm just really like not feeling myself. Um, anyway. So I want to show you guys what I'm packing. I'm really excited about the clothes I'm packing actually. And I'll tell you guys that like so many cute outfits, like, I don't know. Okay, I'm like happy, but I'm like crazy right now. Um, and what was I gonna say? Okay, so when I'm gone, um, I think when I'm gone, I'm gonna be doing like a shipping offer, a shipping special. I don't want you guys to think because I'm gone, the business is closed, like it's not, so don't worry. And um, when I'm gone, I'm going to be doing, and I'll be announcing it on my Instagram, because I'm going to London and Paris, I'm gonna be doing free shipping for London and Paris. That is what's going on right now. I might just do free shipping for Europe. I don't know. Right now, this is like it's all in the works, and I'll be doing like a shipping special for um, for the U.S. too. Um, I just want you guys to like know that like HR is, is not closed just because I'm gone for a week. Um, don't think that. And I want to do like just fun. Like oh my god, I'm going to London and Paris. Like you know what I mean? Like let's just I don't know. I don't know. I'm still thinking, but I also announce that on my Instagram. 
but for sure something with people in UK and Paris, uh, sorry, UK and France. Did I say Paris? Stupid. Oh my god, like Paris, the country is so stupid. Um, anyway, and uh, just there's so many things to do before I leave. Um, oh, I want to show you guys my, these are my new um, DOC BH shirts. Have you guys seen them? The Whiteout Collection. I have not shown them on my um, YouTube channel yet. This is them. It's a Whiteout Collection. So it's a white, thick, beautiful cotton shirt all made in USA with Beverly Hills Department of Corrections. And the back is, this is the iconic DOC Beverly Hills. And then Beverly Hills is written in the iconic Beverly Hills script, which you can see I'm wearing my pills as always and my mignon chain. My, I'm wearing, oh my God, I fucking love this so much. This is my mignon, this is my Miami, um, sorry, my Palm Beach. And then this is for my baby girl set, choker, which I love so much. If I'm wearing a choker, unless it's the Lux tattoo, I'll wear the baby girl because I love this one so much. And then my mix and match pendants. I just, they all stack so perfectly. Um, white up collection. So the white-out collection for me, um, I love it because I really wanted, I thought about doing adding another color combo, and I also have them in short and long sleeve, just so you guys know. So if you want it short, they're available, and long available too. And I like the white because it's very crisp and clean. I want you guys to know these are not see-through at all. I'm wearing a bra and you can't even see it, um, so don't worry about that. And then you can see just the color of the Beverly Hills, the, the print does show up. Don't worry about that. It's not, and we're sitting in a bright light too, so it should be actually less obvious but it's way obvious as you can see um they're really fun anyway i like this white white out collection like white out your haters so i thought it's like so cool like just fucking white them out you know i mean get the fuck out of here like, that's what i was like this is so i just i love the concept and you guys are loving it too add them to your collection they're really fun and i thought i would show you um okay so what else am I going to say? Oh, there's the rabbits. I'm, thank, thank God my housekeeper is going to stay at my house when I'm gone. So I don't have to worry about like, you know, bunnies and bunny situation and just like stuff. You know what I mean? And so housekeeper is staying. Thank God. Like that's under control. I don't have to like worry about my bunnies and stuff like that. Um, I don't know. Okay. So I'm just going to get started. I know ramble, ramble where you guys know me, but oh, okay. Yeah. I'm really excited about the clothes I'm bringing because just like, do you guys like try on a, let me show this to you. This is my pile of clothes right now. Okay, this is my pile of clothes. I'm just gonna like show you guys what I'm bringing. It looks like a sea of black. I know, right? There are some things under there that are not black. And um, so that's that. And let me put, bring you back over here. Um, God, like, is that better lighting right here? I don't know, I'm just like really ugly right now, so I apologize. Um, and, okay, so, um, are you guys like me where you try on things before you go and like make outfits? Like I don't understand why I do that or people do that because like you know the outfits you have, like you know the clothes you have, like why are you trying to decide what you're bringing now? You like know what you have, like you know the outfits. It's so stressful, it's so stupid, like I'm not even trying, I don't want to do try hard things on this trip, like honest to god I just want to wear fucking yoga pants like what I always wear in my DOCBH shirt but like do people even wear like that kind of stuff in in like Paris and London? Like no, like they don't. Like people actually like wear like normal human clothes. You know what I mean? Like they don't just wear yoga pants. So I'm trying to like I'm trying to like not be over the top because like I don't want to like try hard, and I didn't want to spend I didn't spend any money. You know what I mean? Like on like clothes for my trip. Like I just think that is so fucking stupid. Like I can't do it. Like I'm not gonna change who I am. Like what I like to wear because I'm going somewhere. At the same time, like, if I'm going to be meeting friends who I've never met, like, I don't want them to be like, oh my god, she's so frumpy and fat and just, like, stupid and, like, ugh, like, oh my god, like, gross. You know what I mean? I kind of want them to look good, but I don't want to, like, try hard. Like, I want to be comfortable. Like, I'm comfortable in my clothes and what I like. So, there are some things I tried on and I was like, I forgot that they looked good on me and I forgot that I liked them. Like, my mom jeans and stuff, which I really, really like. So, I'm bringing those. I'll show you guys. And then I have, like, kind of a crop shirt and, like, my, the, like, the a little bit of like my stomach on the top like not you know I mean not like not like, it's not like shows like this much like kind of cute like I can kind of pull it off like I'm still like super obese but like it doesn't look that bad you know what I mean anyway shut up okay so I'm gonna tell you guys where everything's from and sorry if I'm blinking like it's this fucking light and every time I turn on this camera I get crazy I'm if you meet me in person like actually don't act like this it's so weird it's like as soon as the fucking camera turns on I turn into like this weird person I don't know what it is like I think it's because I don't have a lot of friends and like you I feel like oh my god my friends are here <laughs> like it's so fucking okay 
So the first thing I want to talk about is um, what I'm going to talk about is this long flowy. Do you guys remember? Okay, if you have fo if you follow me on Instagram, by the way, Instagram is totally fucking me over again. Like I have been losing followers like no other. I'm literally going to go below um, 99. I'm going to go below 100k soon. Like I swear to God, um, I cannot gain a follower if my life depended on it. It is so fucking outrageous. Like I either you guys like hate me that much or Instagram is fucking with me because it is insane. Like people actually get followers and I lose followers more than gain. I don't get it. So, um, I don't know. Maybe it's because I look like this. But okay. Um, anyway, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you'd be, you would remember these like pieces because it's, I don't have a lot of clothes. So the ones that I do wear, you'd be like, oh yeah, I remember that. Anyway, this is, everything is basically from Aritzia and like H&M and Zara and that, and DOCBH and Marshalls. Like that's what it is. You guys know that. Like I don't know where else to go. Um, so anyway, this, this is from, um, it's just like a long kind of pleated skirt in chiffon. You know what I mean? It's from, um, it's a medium Babaton. It's from Aritzia and I'm going to wear this with, it's so cute actually. Um, I got this from American Eagle this week from Aerie. Like I love going to that store. They have the best fucking bras. I just got this bra. I, I would lift up my shirt right now and show you guys my, but I'm not going to do that and scare everyone. I got this bra and no, I'm not linking you guys. Like I'm not going to sit here and link bras and shit. Come on. Like it's just like the one that feels like skin. Um, and I really like it and I got like all the colors. I'm wearing like the nude one right now, nude or pink one right now. I really, really like it. Anyway, I got these, they were on sale. Like these little like sweatshirts on sale for $15 this week and I paired this with this and I like tied this in the front and kind of cropped it a little bit and it was so cute so this is gonna be an outfit we'll see if I wear it like you guys know I'll probably get there and just put my fucking yoga pants on like I just know it I'm gonna spend all this time doing this are you exhausted yet I am okay next <laughs> okay Jesus cannot be this anymore I just want oh you guys TMI TMI no this is not TMI but it should be okay these are my um, Levi's, and I really like them. They're about the mom jean Levi's. I will try to put the link for you guys in these because I know you really like them. Um, my the mom jean Levi's. Um, I I do like these a lot, and I'm gonna pair this with this little. I cut this myself. It's just a piece of like literal shit, um, black shirt, and it's like that. Like I'm gonna pair it. it. Actually looks really cute together. I was like, you're fat, but like you actually look good in that. Like I can't believe it. Like. It's actually not that bad. Like I, I don't like hate looking at myself in the mirror. And then I have a black pair of the mom jeans too, which I'm gonna be bringing. And um, I don't know. I think I'm like also like very nervous because not that like anyone will recognize me, but if even like one person says hi, I just don't wish you guys like I just don't want to be like a complete disgusting ugly fat letdown. Um, you know what I mean? But whatever. Anyway, this is a little skirt that I got from H&M. I've been wearing this a lot. I wear this to dinner, and I, I've t worn, I've tagged this, I think, before. Yeah, I have. And I wear it during the day, and I wear it with a big, chunky sweater tucked in in the front. So it's like a tight ruching, and then it kind of, um, like, it's a little cupcake on the bottom, which I don't typically... Did the, the lighting change? It totally did. Um, I really like that. And then... Let me get some more things skirt that I got I wear it with this big chunky sweater and then this big chunky sweater I also like to wear with yoga pants I like to wear with jeans too like my black boyfriend jean mom jeans or whatever boyfriend jeans also from H&M and it's kind of like really soft you know what I mean like I, I like that um then I'm bringing this these are shorts from Aritzia they're from last year though there's like silky shorts black and pink and then I'm bringing those sweaters that I really like from Aritzia. I will put links for things I know for you guys. I will put links but I'm like things that I don't know I'm not gonna look for bras and shit like I'm just you know what I mean like I'm not doing that. That's just like way too much work especially for me right now it's like ugh. Okay you guys know these these v-necks I think they're on sale right now. I have them in black and I have them in in this nude color. I wish they would make them in like every color under the sun because I wear them all the time like um, I wear them with yoga pants, I wear them with jeans, I wear them with skirts, I wear them with every single, in every single, like, thing I can do. Like, if it's either DOCBH or it's these, honestly. Like, that's what I wear. So if you're seeing me wearing a shirt, it's one of those. Okay, then I'm wearing, I'm bringing this. This is also from Aritzia. It's the brand called Little Moon, which I really like. And it's these V-necks, and I wear these with blazers. And I like these because they're super, like, I, I, okay. I feel like anything I like right now is gonna have a 70s twist to it. Like for some reason in my head, it's like kind of 70s. Like, I don't, I don't know, I'm probably like fucking crazy. Um, but 
here's the other one. So the other one is a gold color, and I just feel like this is such like a 1970s color, isn't it? It totally is, right? And it's kind of like, you know what I mean? Like, I feel like I would find this in like a thrift store, like this kind of material. Like, I don't know, I just feel like it's very Versace. Versace. Um, I just really, really love it, and they were kind of expensive, but I do wear them a lot. And um, so those are those two. Um, then I'm wearing, when I bring these, these are those Aritzia Wilfred um, shiny leggings that I wear all the time. I get the medium size. Um, oh, I smell like fresh laundry. I love that. Um, I'm, I'll, I love these. I wear these all the time. These look great with ev every shirt, but I specifically do wear them with my DOCBH a lot, but you can wear them with chunky sweaters, everything. Um, love those. And then this is my new blazer from Aritzia too. It's huge oversized. It's a, a large in Babaton and it's really, really just like effortless. You just throw it on with anything. And I will link this because if you guys are looking for a really great boyfriend um, style blazer, which I love, I feel like boyfriend blazers are a little bit out. Like whenever I wear them, I always feel like I'm so Alex six years ago, but they look amazing. And it's like, I can't not wear, they always look good. They always tie in an outfit. Like you throw this on with yoga pants and like a cute, it's like tank underneath. And you just looks like your model on the go. It is so fucking cute. Like, and this is a really, really great one. Um, I'm bringing that. Then I'm bringing this. Do you guys know this long? Do you guys like this on me? If you follow me on Instagram, you would fucking know, okay? Do you guys like this on me? It's that long, um, it's like tight dress, um, really long. And it's by Adidas, as you can see. And then the sleeves have, it goes really, really long. And it's really tight the whole way down. And you guys know I did have lipo. Um, and I haven't, I haven't done like a lipo follow-up. I don't like doing like follow-up things. So lipo, I will just quickly say lipo. I just didn't like... I fucking ate like stupid pig after lipo, you know, thinking, oh my god, I look good. Lipo doesn't like make you skinny, it just reshapes you. So now, like a year later almost, or I think it's a year later, it totally did wonders for my body in that I used to have flanks. Like, for example, that skirt, okay, the skirt or the mom jeans, I could never have worn before because I would grow, I grew out. Like, I wasn't straight, I would grow out. Um, so I had like bad flanks. And I mean, I'm really good at angle, like taking pictures. I'm really good at like angling, like a lot of girls are. Um, so you might have been like, oh, Alex, whatever. But seriously, like if I wore this, you guys know, a lot of you guys who have like my shape body or whatever, these kind of problems will understand what I'm talking about. But you know, if you wear these on like a body that has like flanks, you look like a snowman, right? Because your fat underneath here would pop, push out and then you look like that. You know what I mean? You'd go like that and then up. And that's what I was. It was like gross. So now I can wear this. And I mean, I'm still a little bit fat, but instead of it being like that, it would just be like just a little bit, you know what I mean? Just like not too bad at all, like almost straight. So he completely fixed that. So now like um, that I'm like gaining weight, I'm not gaining weight there again. I'm like gaining weight in my thighs. You know what I mean? Like I'm getting fatter in my thighs and I've like never been fat in my thighs. So it's like my fault. So, he, you know, like the lipo does work, but if you're going to be gaining weight, you're going to gain it other places. Like I even think my arms are like getting like a little bit fatter than like normal. Like they're thicker than they were. They're just, you know, the fat is starting to see that starting to like go places that it wasn't before um so i don't know what i'm gonna do I, I would probably do it again like go for the round but i know that like there's so many regulations and stuff in like the u.s like i i don't, I don't think i would go abroad to do it but i know that there's people like who go to like Colombia or something and they come out like really really like i know it's not safe but it's just a whole a totally different thing um I think I might, I would probably do it again, like, just have, like, some more reshaping, like, why not? I don't know, I'm not, like, afraid of it, so, and I did have, ultimately, I had a good experience, and the fact that I'm gaining back in different places is my fault, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know, it's like, uh, I don't know, like, I, I don't know, I like it, but it's not, if you're thinking about lipo to make you, like, lose weight or take off fat, it's not going to do that. Okay. So this, do you guys like this? So anyway, I would have never been able to wear this before because it's like very straight and now I'm like pretty straight, which I always wanted to be. I didn't like that I had like flanks. Um, so go look on my Instagram, tell me if you guys like this. I like this, I really like it. I'm wearing, I'll wear it with yoga pants underneath. Um, Adidas yoga pants with like the three stripes on the side. So it just looks very like, looks very like chic. I really, really like it. Okay. Then, what else am I going to wear? I have this. This is from H&M. I wear this all the time, too. This is a really old sweater, but I just love this color. It's also so 70s, and it looks so gorgeous with my... I'm trying to, like, put these over. With my pendants thrown... I would never... 
I wore my pendants and everything, but like look how gorgeous it is with a high neck with these pendants. It's like so pretty. I fucking love it so much. Um, and yeah, so this with any of the shorts I'm going to bring is so cute. And with my leggings, those Wilfred leggings. And then I am bringing all three of my DOCBH. I'm bringing my white one. And then I'm bringing my trusty black, which I wear this, like, if you guys ever see me, I'm probably wearing this. DOCBH Beverly Hills is the front. Oh, it's the back, but this is the front. Long sleeve. And then I'm bringing my pink one, too, which is my... This one, I know a lot of these are sold out right now, but if you, you do see your size, get them because it's like takes a while for us to bring them back in. You know what I mean? It's like I'm, it's a small business, you guys, so it's not like I can like have hundreds of thousands of pieces all the time. All right. And then it seems, you know what it seems like too? It seems like the the pieces that are sold out are the ones you guys want. It's like, and then the, and the ones you guys like, it's weird. It's like what I don't have you want. And then when you, then when you're like, oh, I wish, you, you know what I mean? It's like, I can never make like you guys happy. It's so weird. Um, okay. And this is the same V-neck uh, Aritzia top I talked about. I have two of them because I love them so much. This is a huge chunky sweater. I'm just bringing it just in case. Um, from Zara, I wear, you guys know this one too. Can I wear like cutoffs with like my Gucci, um, like cutoff black shorts with my Gucci tights for like nighttime there? Like, I feel like I'm a little bit too California, but like I don't want to, you know what I mean? I don't know. I don't want to look like a complete freak, but at the same time, I'm not going to like not be me. You know what I mean? I don't, I don't know. I can't. I can't just like, I would feel so uncomfortable if I'm like wearing something I would never wear here. These are another cute pair of shorts I got from um, Aritzia that are out right now. They're by Tallulah. I got a medium, and this is them. I really, really love these. These are so trusty. Like, I can wear these day and night. They're very slimming. They're very cute. They're not too short. And then this is a high neck. I love high neck shirts, even though I have big boobs. I have, I love these high neck shirts. I think they're just like so fab. Even I love high neck shirts with my pendants coming out of them. It's just so chic. It's so like, Where's my other one? You guys know I'm in love with these. The high neck shirt, any high neck shirt with these like that is just so chic. I love it. Fucking love it. Um, this is another sweater. Okay, and then this is a long cape trench. Okay, tell me what you guys think about this. This is a long, I've got, this is also from Aritzia, uh, Wilfred Medium. It's called the Durante Jacket. And I love this. Okay, it's a long, just straight, like, um, cape, I guess. Not cape, but... Um, what is it? Tunic? No. Like duster? Um, kimono? Kimono, but like, yeah, it's a kimono, I guess. But it's just black, and it's not super shiny, which I like, so it's not so dressy. Can I like, wear this with yoga pants? Because I kind of want to do it. I just don't want to look like, I, I don't want it to look like a hairdresser smock. Like, you know when you go to a hairdresser, you put like a black robe over? I don't want to look like that with yoga pants, because that's, you know, when you, when you go to the hairdresser, you wear yoga pants and shit. So, like... You know, anyway, this at night is gorgeous, like with shorts or like those Wilfred um, leggings. But can I wear this with yoga pants and just like rock it? I don't know. I tried it on the other day. It looked kind of fucking weird. I, I, I don't know. Um, my jewelry I'm going to bring. I'll show you guys some pieces. These are like, these are my HRH AB pouches, which come with all jewelry orders, $35 and over. Unless you're getting Privé, Privé comes in special signature boxes. Um, but if you would rather have a pouch, you can always, they're iridescent, they're really, really cool, and it says HRH on the front. If you'd rather have a pouch than a signature Privé box, just let me know in the notes section, and I can totally do that swap for you. Just let me know. Okay, this one is my, ooh, this is my meds, so, and then for meds collection, which are my pill bracelets, these are just two of the three I have, you get these signature boxes, and it says HRH, ooh, and gold on the inside. This is my silver set, so I have all three silver pills. In here and then I have my um, sterling silver chevalier and my chain ring which I'm bringing obviously because either I'm wearing I'm either wearing the gold set or the silver set and then I'm put it in here and then I'm wearing here's a big my chunky chains I'm wearing right now I love this my mignon I also love the mignon in the um, rose gold it's a really pretty rose gold this is my LV clasp choke long choker which I love and then my, of course, my Lux Tattoo choker, and then my Palm Beach in silver, and I'm wearing the Palm Beach in gold too, here, but in silver. These are just so easy to throw on. They really like, just make your outfit so much cooler. So there's that, and then 
I have my pendants in silver. So I have my, oh, Chao Bella. This is my Chao Bella set. A lot of you guys love this. One's a, like a longer necklace and one's like a longer choker. It's really, really, really cool, that set. And I have the gold set too. I'm gonna bring that, I forgot about that. And then I have my pendants in the silver. The silver star and the silver heart in here. It's the same thing like this, but silver. Okay, am I forgetting anything? I wanted, you guys, I forgot my pearl choker. I brought it to work to, for measurements, and then I forgot, I forgot them there. I'm so mad, because I really wanted to wear them there. So fucking mad. Okay, um, I haven't picked out shoes and bags yet. I don't know what to do, but, oh, I want to show you guys this. so cute. I got this yesterday it, at, um, I think I got it at Urban, and it's a little tiny mini caboodle, and I thought it would be so cute for my makeup for travel. It's like a tiny one. It was only $10. I just think it's like adorable. If it ends up being a complete waste of space, like doesn't carry anything, it just being like more pro more effort than it's worth, I'm just going to leave it. But I hope my makeup will fit in here and like be so cute. Like, you know what I mean? Just like, I, I never get to travel, so I think it would be fun to do like travel stuff. And then... Um, this is like the bag I've been using like every day practically you guys know that this is my Fendi bucket bag and this is what it looks like when you buy it pretty much and then this is what I've done to it with my HRH pieces this is the bow uh, the pearl bow strap and um, a lot of you they're on they're still on pre-order they're gonna be shipping out for good like they're gonna be shipping out all of you guys been waiting so long thank you so much for your patience um, you're still getting that good price so what they're, they're at a lower price until they um, are ready to be shipped out. So these are available right now at pre-order status, but the benefit of ordering it now is you're getting, I think, $15 off. So they come in this color and they come in a beige, and then you can choose silver or gold hardware. And then I also added this chain to the front. I just think it's... I think it's like so ugly like that. I think it's so much cooler. Like it makes the bag so amazing. Um, if you are ordering the chain, this this chain for your bucket bag, I'm gonna have to add a, a lot more on it. Like, So if you order a mini size from the site, it's gonna be like that. If you want one for your bucket bag, you have to leave a note in the note section at checkout that you want and then we'll invoice you. I think it's like another 15, 10 or $15 additional. Um, but just let me know that you want it for your bucket bag so that it will lay like that. Actually, I do think it should be one link shorter, don't you think? Do you think so? I think it might be better. No, I like like that because I like the way it hangs right on the edge. Okay, so that's that. I love this bag so much. Like, it's just so easy to carry. It's so easy to hold. And then I just love all of the the straps. It's just so cute. Okay, the two shoes that I have picked out for right now. Um, oh, you guys, I would like tell me any advice. Like, tell me like what. You think I should, I'm missing from this? Besides, like, shoes and underwear and stuff. Like, what else am I missing? I'm, I already showed you the sunglasses I might be bringing. This is just alternative. And then, um, I think I'm going to bring these. My Chanel. These. Um, I'm not going to bring, like, super high heels. Because I'm there to, like, you know what I mean? Even at night, like, I, I'm not going to, like... These are, like, the highest heels I'm going to bring. These. Because they're super comfortable. These are Prada. So that's what I have now. Um, shoes for the day during the day. I'm literally gonna bring my Fendi slides. Like, do people not wear open-toed shoes? Like, like open-toed like flats, like slides. I feel like everything. Every time I watch people on Instagram who live um, like abroad, they are like more not. They're not so casual, you know. And I don't want to look like a frump, but at the same time, it's like that's what I wear. Anyway, that's it. I hope you guys like this. Um, and I'm excited, but I'm also anxious. And that's it. So I will um, follow me on Insta. Follow me on Instagram so that I don't start losing more followers. It's like so crazy. Like I'm like, oh my god. Like what the fuck am I doing wrong? Like, oh my god. It's like, ugh, what? Like shit. Like oh my god. Everyone hates me. <laughs> what did I do? But um, follow me there because I'll be traveling and I'll probably be like Insta storying a lot and stuff. And I never get to travel, so. Um, and I'm really excited to, like, I'm, I'm going, I'm, like, really excited, to, like, to go on the plane. Like, we don't, I'm not going first class, but I'm going business, and it's, like, I'm feel, gonna feel, like, super bouge. Like, I see all these people going, like, fabulous trips, and, like, finally I'm gonna get to go, like, on, like, a cool, I don't know. I'm just, like, excited, okay? Um, but at the same time, for other reasons, I'm not. <laughs> it's so fucked up. All right, you guys, I love you so much. Thank you so much for watching, and, um, like, you guys know, you guys are, like, my friends, so sorry if I come on here. I'm, like, overly excited, but... Like, I don't really talk to that many people.
people except for like Judy at work. So anyway, I love you guys. Okay, bye.